Welcome to Movie Phones Unscripted. I am Toby McGuire, and I am here with Natalie Portman and Jake Joan Hall, and we're here to talk about our movie brothers. We're going to ask each other uh, some of your questions, and as well as some of our own. I'll start with the first one. From Barb in Champaign, Illinois. Hmm. Jake, what was the best part of playing Toby's brother? Hmm. If you were brothers in real life, would there be sibling rivalry? Yes, Barb, there would be sibling <laughs> rivalry. <laughs> Well, you know, what's great is that Barb, uh, it's, this is odd. You don't have to call know, me Barb. I know, but it's weird because Barb asked it, and then you're asking me, and then I'm talking to you about a question that Barb already asked. I think but she's anyway. Barb's fill-in in in that moment. Okay. Um, I can also be Barb. We can both be Barb. <laughs> okay. I'm going to Barb both of you, okay? You know, we worked out together, we played sports together, like, we, we connected. We dude it out. We dude it out together, yeah. And, like, I feel like if we were brothers in real life, I feel like that... That would be a really great part of being being brothers. Yes. But we don't even Work need to be brothers together, to have that happen. <laughs> That's true. And uh, this is cute. It's happening here. Although I feel kind of uncomfortable. Being <laughs> no, no. As Barb, I'm really interested, and as Toby, I'm touched. <laughs> <laughs> From Lauren in Burlington, Vermont. You lost weight for this role. How did you train for the film? During filming, uh, but I was eating twelve to thirteen hundred calories a day, and in five to six meals, and you know, I would just work out a ton and um and then I during that. yeah yes we did it together well yeah but i remember you eating nothing which oh was yeah yeah it was very hard to watch yeah it's not fun my wife just generally said i was not fun to be around for the whole shooting of the mo movie <laughs> true what were the best and worst scenes to film mm. i know the worst because it was the hardest was our scene when I confess to you that I kissed Jake. That was hard because we just didn't really know what we were doing. And yeah. we talked about it like all day long. And we didn't shoot for like five hours while talking about it. It was cool when something happened finally and it sort of felt, but it still wasn't, it still never really on set. We never really felt like, oh yeah, yeah I nailed that one. Yeah. Um, but in the editing room, Jim, and then we keep... That's how you edit, by yeah, the way. Right. <laughs> With some, <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> movie. Um, yeah. And the best one. You can say it. He's kissing me. You can say it. You can say it. I was going to say we're all eating that's the what vegan we're all meatloaf. <laughs> <laughs> ah, like, nice. Only. But sort of randomly, so. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Anyway, sorry, Jake. If I had a best scene, it would have been that. Kissing me. Unscripted. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> so you mentioned that... Um, you and Toby mm -hmm. have often been told that you look like one another <laughs> in the past. I'm so glad we can clear this up. That you've been <laughs> mistaken for one another. Mm -hmm. Have you ever, or would you ever, pretend to be Toby? I was once on a plane. The plane was deboarding after we arrived in our location. And a, a wonderful older woman walked up to me and she said, Oh, excuse me. And I said, Oh, yeah. And she said, Can I tell my son? That I was on the plane with Spider Man. <laughs> and I said, Yeah, yeah sure. sure, no problem, you can. So, yeah, there have been times, unfortunately, I've used your identity. Blackie in LA says, There's a band named Natalie Portman's Shaved Head. Love them. Um, if fans named a band after you, what would it be called, Jake? And what type of music would they play? First of all, I'd just like to say, Jackie in Los Angeles, that's the best question anyone's ever asked me. I would call my band, um, the band that I would like to be called, uh, Jake Gyllenhaal's Merkin. For those of you who don't know what a Merkin is, it's... Jake a, has alopecia and his people. <laughs> 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 anyway, <laughs> the publicists are like... How do we get that out? <laughs> uh, it's not true. That will also be the promo for the show. <laughs> Jake, if you had pubic hair in your <laughs> groin area. Uh, you and, just like to wear wigs. And, and they, I, no, no, that's not a merkin <laughs> like that. A merkin. <laughs> <laughs> what kind of merkin? Wait a second. Wait a second. Okay. <laughs> what I mean is that... A merkin is what you wear in a sex scene in a movie that covers up your genital area. It doesn't have to be hair. It doesn't? I thought no. It was, Look I it thought up it on was... Wikipedia. First of all, I'd like to say that that's a bad rumor to start with. But, but an awesome one also. But kind of awesome. But then... Shakes merkin. 
Yeah, why not? That's a great name for a band. Yeah. And I think they should play like trance, trance hip hop. <laughs> Holly in <laughs> Syosset. Holly! In Syosset, in New York? What up? But wait, Syosset's my hometown. Yeah, but it says Holly <laughs> in Syosset, in New York. Like, where else? Okay, is it? yeah. Where else would Syosset be except New York? What? See, hey, she Holly. did that. It's like hip hop, Natalie coming through. Do you freestyle, <laughs> by the way? No. Um, All right. I loved seeing but you, you on it, Top you? Chef this season. What's your favorite meal? Um, Top Chef was the peak of my career. I don't even have any more goals. I've achieved all my goals. What did you, what happened on Top Chef? Uh, it was a vegan challenge. Really? Yes, it was. That's awesome. Mm hmm And it was uh, two vegans. I know. I feel like at a loss. I didn't see it. Yeah. So Inspiring. Eat, so I eat something with eggs one day. It was. Did you? No. I was vegan the whole time we were shooting. I wasn't afterwards. <laughs> Your, your folks, this is what your folks sent about, you. I, I saw you eat eggs one day. But you know you. what? They were eggs. One of the reporters it. just told me that you eat chocolate sometimes. Oh. Guys, guys, calm down. <laughs> Seriously, calm down. Mistakes can be Hold made. On. I want to address this chocolate thing. I don't know. I just thought this was kind of embarrassing slash funny. Somebody who I'm a huge fan of, Kate Winslet, had seen um, Tropic Thunder, which I had two shots in the movie and she said to me it was the crowning my crowning achievement in my career it's I was kind of an I was, no 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 I was happy <laughs> that Kate Winslet was just talking to me so I was just like excited <laughs> that she like acknowledged my presence but then at the same time I was like that's it like 